into springtime flowers and rays of summer sun, catching wet snowflakes on your nose, running through autumn leaves that float from trees on high with our love that is bigger than the sky. Guess so much I love you, guess so much I love you, guess so much I love you. Guess so much I love you, guess so much I love you, guess how much I love you. Guess how much I love you. Field of Flowers It was spring, and everyone was enjoying the plentiful food in the meadow. Little Nut Brown Hare was eager to pick a tasty breakfast to share with his father, Big Nut Brown Hare. Are these ripe yet? Yes, they look good. When he was surprised by a most unusual event. Oh, look, a walking flower. <laughs> Good morning, Nut Brown Hairs. <laughs> Hello, little field mouse. That's a good hiding spot. Is it a hiding spot, Big Nut Brown Hair? It's a flower. Indeed it is. A wonderful flower. A very wonderful flower. It's so big and so purple. There's plenty more, just like this one, in the meadow. I'll show you if you like. Can I have a flower too? Of course. Hooray! Let's pick flowers! <laughs> but don't pick too many. You never know who else might want those flowers. All right, we won't pick too many. <laughs> Here are those 
butterflies again. I wonder why they followed us all this way. It's because they like the nectar from the flowers. Nectar? What's that? Nectar is their food and drink. I wonder why they didn't stay at the flower bed where you picked all those flowers. I, I don't know. There were plenty of flowers there. Oh, well, there were plenty of flowers there. How many did you pick? Quite a few. Quite a lot. A bunch for everyone. Oh, dear. We didn't mean to. We know you told us not to. We just started picking, and before we knew it, uh -huh. we picked them all. But there are so many other flowers here. Why don't the butterflies drink nectar from them? They like some flowers more than others. They do love these purple ones. But this bunch of flowers won't be enough for all these butterflies, will it? No. Oh no! We've taken all the butterflies' flowers. The poor butterflies. Wait a minute. I flew over a big field of purple flowers this morning. Did you? Where? It's quite a long way away. If only we could find a way to get the butterflies to it. They do look thirsty. I have an idea. Bluebird, if you lead the way, we can follow you to the field of purple flowers. Yes. And we'll use this bunch of flowers to lead the butterflies there. That's a great idea. All right, let's go. Don't worry, little butterflies. We'll soon get you to a whole field of flowers. that day. From then on, he looked at things a little differently. Oh, we've had the most wonderful day. We picked all these flowers. Oh, how many? Too many, because the butterflies needed them as well. Did they? Yes, flowers are there for everyone to share. That's right, my little nut brown hair. And I have something to share. With you. You do? It's a secret. Guess how much I love you. As much as butterflies love flowers? As much as butterflies and flowers love each other. <gasps> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go home. Whee! 